Hello everybody, welcome back, welcome back. My name is Charlotte Creates here on YouTube and I create videos about writing, writing in journals, and journaling. Today is not one of those days though. Today I thought that we would just kind of sit down and chat for a chill, nice video because I decided to create a map a couple of weeks ago and here is the outcome. So, as everybody knows, Nano is upon us and by now, I mean, if you don't know the memo, you're like three weeks late, but yeah, it's nano time. And if you didn't watch my last two vlogs and my Preptober vlog and my panic video, then you know, you don't know, well, I guess I'm telling you now that I created my nano project on the spot. I created an idea on the spot and I had no idea what I was going to do. For my project see writers hit writer's block about midway through nano i hit writer's block on the first day of nano <laughs> which is so helpful that i made this map because basically you know when you make a map you can't have things on a map that don't pertain to the real like well not real world but the world that you're creating right so it was just so fun to sit down and sketch out a random image that I later inked with India ink and my favorite quill, aka my favorite pen to ink with in general because it has a big fe turkey feather on the end and who does- actually, that's a lie. That's not a turkey feather. That's a goose fe feather. <laughs> a geese feather? That's a goose feather. Um, but I love it all the same. And yeah, so that's what I'm doing now. And it was just, I don't know, do you guys ink? I just love inking things because it's so fun. Oh, and that right there, I created a prison. That's gonna be a prison. Why? That's a good question. I'll figure that out one day as I'm writing. But yeah, I just created random things on this map and decided to name them based on what I already knew about my story. And it's just a helpful way for me to figure out where everything in the land is located and to know like the temperature that's why I like to create these maps enough about the map though I'm just as you can see I'm adding in small details and I'll just pop in something comes up that I really enjoyed and I'm really excited to write about so <laughs> let's talk about nano struggles I don't want to talk to you about my word count but basically this video was supposed to go up last Monday but due to circumstances that ain't happening as you can see because I didn't publish anything last Monday but basically for those of you guys who don't edit on your phone I do and it's so friggin hard I mean I have a 64 gigabyte phone so I can own and it's it's my phone for editing filming and basically my life um, you can imagine how many times I run out of storage which is why I can only edit one video at a time which is time consuming and just not as effective like I rather edit three videos at a time because with vlogs you know it's your it's your life you're editing a life by life thing so I I just like to edit vlogs as I go I don't know first world problems how do you guys edit on a phone what software do you use to edit on that's where I stand on that but yeah so I've also had to to experiment with a bunch of random apps because iMovie app keeps on crashing on me for some reason maybe it's just because I film a lot and it's not even that everything I film is interesting it's more so that I just ramble a lot but I enjoy rambling, <laughs> which is why this is a chill sit and talk with me. But yeah, that's where I am now. And oh yeah, so you can see that I have created dark borders to indicate the boundaries between each kingdom. And look, I drew a dragon. Actually, I wouldn't say it's a dragon because I do have a dragon species, so it'd be awkward if there were dragons that are water dragons like the one I drew, and dragons that are like land dragons that have human faces. So, you know what? Maybe it's just like a serpent thing. Anyways, I don't know, but I do know that my character, my main character, might keep it as a pet. But we'll see where that happens. And yeah, then of course I decided I'd age it to add even more to the fact that I was already behind in Nano. <laughs> I decided to, instead of writing 
aging my map is 10 times more important you gotta have priorities am i right but yeah i had fun aging it and then i used some tim holtz and some other stamping ink to give it a vintagey look and i spent so long for this to dry it took so long to dry and i had to cut out so much footage of just me sitting there like trying to blow <laughs> on my map to dry the the tea it was rough it was a rough life but yeah that's where i am with nano i'm behind about two weeks now <laughs> and i don't know i just finished an exam which i'm kind of proud of which is why i'm filming this this is my reward um because i finished my exam my reward is that i get to film this video well not film because i filmed before but like talk and chill with you guys so yeah if you like this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe down below hit that notification bell and i will see you whenever i see you f on fridays for my next vlog bye